What's up, guys? Dustin Huey here, back with the Toronto Maple Leafs GM mode. And my voice sounds amazing. I could sing, but I'm not going to. It's too, I'm too awesome. Um, I tweeted out earlier that my voice went from a six-year-old old lady smoker to a seven-year-old old lady smoker. I sound like a classy broad. Anyways, um, so we're 31-19 forward. We're not doing too bad right now. Um... I was looking at some stuff, so obviously I put Clarkson on there last time. I'm gonna put Bozak as well. Um, I personally like Bozak as a real like as a real player, but um, for the sake of this, yeah, he's only three and a half potential. Um, he's already 27, and his contract is outrageous. 3.895 million for five years still. Um, the other person, obviously Clarkson, is stupid. 4.89 for seven years, like. Who the hell, I don't know why they would make those freaking, uh, why they would even sign those deals so bad. Um, the other thing was, I was looking at uh, potential candidates to trade for. Um, so the biggest one was Johansson from uh, Columbus. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Ryan Johansson, he's a playmaker center. He's four and a half stars, 21 years old. Um, there's obviously room for him to, to get a lot better. So he's only 21, which is good. So he's got like four more years of potential in him. Um, so that could be a potential, f like, second-line center for us in the future. We don't have lots of playmakers as well, so um, if we would be able to nab them, maybe for Kadri somehow, or not Kadri, um, Bozak somehow, um, or even Boland, like, I don't know. Um, yeah, like, I wouldn't even be against moving Boland even. Bozak could say, like, I don't care, it's just... Um, yeah, and then the other player I was looking at for a right wing would be Kyle Palm Palmieri. Um, I don't know if that'd be possible, but he is a right right wing to a forward. He's got four star potential. He's only twenty two. Um, oh, I got Steez. <coughs> oh God, it's full on cold, cold sickness. Oh geez. Um, oh man, sorry about that. Okay. Um. Br 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 but yeah, basically, I'm going to sim through the uh, trade deadline this episode. So, um, yeah, I was kind of taking a peek. Uh, Did we ever do Backland? I don't think so. Mikhail Backland. We got Granland. Backland's a little old, though. He's 24. That's the thing, eh? Um, yeah, like, I feel like Palmieri would be good. And his value's about the same as Gra or uh, Niederreiter or Sad, so... I don't know. It was just ideas I was throwing out there. All right, so that's possibility at um, at the trade deadline. We can take a look at that if we don't get any offers. Uh, I'm going to keep going here. Uh, the one thing I was thinking about that would be cool, I'd like to um, obviously do a, another wish list video soon, hopefully. But um, Leonard, Leonard's in there right now. Um, I think for trading, it would be cool if you could offer, like, if you could like kind of discuss with the other GM. And be like, okay, I'm looking at so and so. Um, for instance, Johansson, and I want to offer you Clarkson. What else do I need to do to actually make that trade work? And then they would give you back, okay, well, you could give us so and so. And then basically you could counter offer that, you know, kind of work out a deal with them. I think it would be a lot more straightforward than just like them being like, oh, that's not enough value, you know? Wow, Leonard, you just got lit up, bro. Um,. I actually started recording this before, but um, my my uh, Elgato, I wanted to call it my hot pod. My Elgato wasn't recording my uh, my voice, so I was like, what the frick? So I had to restart, and we actually won those three games. Oh, well. Um, so I was also looking at uh, Bernier and Leonard the way, because they're both classes starting goalies. Um, I basically, I'm going to give Bernier six more games, and then Leonard's going to start the rest, but um, because Leonard's class is a, as a starting goalie, but... He's only played 21 games, and we're already 50-some games in. So basically, he needs to start a whole lot of games. Um, so anyways, yeah, I'm going to do Bernier for six games. I don't know if I'm going to do the six right away, but like if he loses two, I'll take him out. But um, yeah, basically six more games than Leonard. I kind of want to keep in for the rest of the season if possible. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, the whole trading thing. If I can get rid of Bozak, I like Bozak personally, but his contract is just awful. Same with, and Clarkson, I, I'm not really, I can't say I'm a huge fan of him, but um, his contract is just awful. Like, I don't know what they were thinking about doing there with that with that uh, contract. Just horrible, you know, so. 
<laughs> really. Come on, guys. And the Johansson thing would be good. Oh, my God. Why are we losing? Jeez. Seriously. Okay, let's put JVR back on the first line there. Uh, Caudry back there. Put Bozak down there again. Uh, and... Uh, power play. Someone told me to put uh, Kessel back on his normal side. I don't know. Like everyone tells me to go. Oh, put him on his offhand. Oh, put him on. No, he's. Oh, put him on his forehand. I don't know what you guys want. <laughs> I don't know what you guys want. Okay, so we're at the uh, Olympic break here. So. Uh, okay, so the other thing was the scouting. Uh, dub. It was Dub defenseman, I believe. That's where that uh, guy was. That one dude that you guys were talking about. Um, nope, that's not what I wanted. I want like this. Oh, there we go. It's this guy you guys are talking about. Julius Honka, apparently. Apparently he's good. I don't know. So, we'll give her a try. Uh, defenseman dub, six weeks. Yeah, okay. We'll give him a try and see how he is, but, uh, there we go. So the trade deadline is coming, so we're going to try and do that trade if we can. Uh, get into the playoffs. <clears throat> Because basically I want to record the playoffs before my voice gets um, even more sore. So, um, <coughs> one sec here. <laughs> there we go. Because, I mean, playoffs you guys can give me input, but it's not like I can really do much about it. So, um, if I can just wrap up the season right now. Um, before the weekend, then Saturday, Sunday, I have videos already made. I, I'm going to try and make a Snipe City. I don't know how. My voice is really bad, so. Um, yeah, I just, I honestly, I'll have to record it today, though, because, um, and then I'll have to edit it, like, Sunday morning. I just don't have time this weekend. My weekend is ridiculous. Like, I'm not even in my house tomorrow. I have school, and then I, um, have a bunch of family stuff to do, so. Yeah, my weekend's ridiculous. Um, oh my god, guys, why are we losing so much right now? Ugh, this is bull crap. Come on. Pick it up, guys. I think Leonard's in that again. He's not doing very good, though. There we go, finally. Let's get a win. We've lost uh, quite a few games since I started simming here. Yeah, that bothers me when, when you, um, like, sometimes when I, like, sometimes the the Elgato doesn't record or whatever. Uh, train block. So then, basically, it doesn't record my audio, and then I notice, and I'm like, oh, crap. But then, like, the sim is completely different. Like, like I said, we won the first three games in a row, and then when I restarted, we lost two out of three, you know? It's kind of stupid. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm looking at, I'm thinking. Uh, I don't know what other players to really look for we got Cody CC so I'm not really worried about defense right now we have TJ Brennan as well um, I'm hoping at the draft we can get something too what can we do here maybe just look for another uh, I guess depth would it be depth that's probably what I want right yeah, depth. Look for a depth forward. Man, they made Louis LeBlanc terrible. He's like 76 now. Wow. Holy moly. Um, yeah, that's what I want. And then I'll do depth defenseman as well, I guess. Oops, defenseman. Other depth, I guess. Da -da -da -da. Oops. Na -na 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 Probably go younger, actually. 24 is a little old. Yeah, there's not that many guys, eh? Oh, did they make Truba better? Oh, four stars. Okay, that's a little bit better. They should have They should have made him four and a half, though. Truba is disgusting. He's going to be so good in, like, a couple years. Ridiculous. All right, there we go. So we're going to go into the trade deadline. Um, I believe I only have two phones, I think. So I'm just kind of winging it. I haven't tried any of the trades. Most of the time, before I make a trade, I'll try it. Because, um, like, somebody asked me, oh, how did you know that trade was going to work? Basically, for the most part, because I like to actually get in-depth with trades and, like, make sure I get the best deal possible. Um, most of the time, I will actually go through and uh, basically make sure the trade works. If I can get the best deal, and then... Because it's on hard, so it's actually harder to make trades, obviously. Um... 
But yeah, I like to make sure I get the best deal possible. Wow, Calgary has so much cap space. Um, okay, so first off, I want to get uh, Johansson. I don't know how that's going to work, though, because... Yeah. Um, they don't have that much cap space, which sucks. Uh, Johansson for uh, Bozak, I guess. Yeah, see, that's the thing. Look at their cap. Ah! Uh, the deal is just shy. I guess the other one I could try is Boland, even. We could try Boland, but Bozak's contract is worse. That's the thing. Oh, man. Actually, that would, it says it's going to work. Boland for Johansson. Um, then Bozak can stay second line. Because, I mean, Boland is a... Although, he's really good defensively. Hold on. How's Bozak doing? Uh, Bozak. Actually, Bozak's not bad, but he's minus 23. My God. That's brutal. What's Bolin plus minus wise? It's just Bolin's defense is just a little bit better, you know? Yeah, like he's 28 points and he's plus 3. Ah, oh, man, that sucks. Yeah, you know what? I kind of want to get rid of Bozak instead. No, not Boland. There you go. I'd rather try and get rid of Bozak. All right, so the cap space is what hurts me. Plus, I need to add extra, which sucks. Um, Holland, Lekkonen. I think Lekkonen's that four-star I signed, yeah. Uh, Finn. Lekkonen, Finn. Uh, did I put... No, Lekkonen's not even in the lineup. He's really young. All right, Lekkonen. I gotta basically take on a terrible contract here. Nikitin, ugh, that's horrible. Uh, see, like, I don't want to lose too much out of... Atkinson wouldn't be bad. Uh, Jack Skilly. McKenzie. See, I don't think either of... What's this guy? Derek McKenzie, three stars. Uh, bull, no. Alright, if we can do that. Atkinson. Just, I don't think that trade's gonna go through. We need to add in something here. Alright, oh, why does it do that? Okay, there we go. Um, okay, so let's try Hertzog, maybe. Who's the other unsigned guy we have? Uh, Rupert. Try Rupert. Rupert. Uh, and we're going to have to add a draft pick, I think. Could try next year's third. That's not unreasonable, next year's third. I just feel like we got to add quite a bit here. Or I could trade Gibson or Sparks, but... Yeah, they don't really want to do that, okay. Uh, next year's third wouldn't be a big issue. And it's not unreasonable, it's not really that bad. Bozak, Lekin, and Rupert... And next year's third. I don't think that's going to work, but... Uh, let's just, let's throw in a fourth, too. Phoenix or Washington. Let's do Washington. No, yeah. Doesn't meet our... Doesn't meet our block needs all that well. Are you kidding me? That's so stupid, man. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty bad at trades. When it comes to just first tries, so. Um, I literally thought that would have went through, though. Bozak. That was brutal. Uh, we just don't have enough to give up, you know? I don't want to give up Ashen or Holland. Lekkonen I'd be willing to part with, but apparently that's not good enough for them. So... Uh, we could give up Finn. I don't think he's really going to turn into anything. Wickstrand. Uh, they would take Wickstrand, though, actually. And he's not in the lineup, either. He's three and a half stars. Although, I'd rather get rid of Finn. Okay, let's see here. Bozak, Lekkonen, Finn. Uh, unsigned. But, but that means we got to take on two two extra guys here. Uh, I'll throw Herzog. Okay, what do we got here? 
So if I can take Air or uh, Atkinson, do I want Atkinson or Calvert? Which one's younger? Oh, they're the same age, eh? Yeah, whatever. Atkinson. And then we gotta absorb one other guy here. Um, let's go with this dude. I don't want him, but whatever. We gotta give up a little bit here. Okay, what do we got for? Lekkinen. These guys are worth, like, nothing. Um, these guys are worth way more. Like, I don't understand how the trades work sometimes. I'm just not good at them, I guess. Maybe next year's second? No, yeah. See, I don't... <laughs> I gave them way more value, but it just doesn't work. Calgary got Frederick Gauthier from Ottawa? What the frick? That's hilarious. Jeez. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not very good at trades. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, let's see if we can get Palmieri then. Um... Palmieri for Clarkson. Straight up, technically that would work. Uh, what's his defense like? 82, 81, 83. See, that's the thing. I think Clarkson's defense is way better. Yeah, it's way better. I just don't like him. He's... I don't know. Wait, how old is he? He's like 29, too, yeah. Palmieri is like 21, or no, 23, sorry, yeah. So he's still got a couple years to get better. Uh, what else would they take here? Uh, da -da 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 -da. Is this guy even worth that much more? I don't even know. Rupert, and then Edmonton third. Let's throw in our... Next year, third. Would that be enough? Because, like, again, that's pretty much even. Oh, what's our... Uh, you have great jam rep. Rupert, a third for Palmieri. Will that work? Because I'm adding in quite a bit here. Well, not quite a bit, but... I probably have to add in a little more. No, they can't take that. Son of a bitch! Um... Yonk, they want to get rid of Yonkman. Here, who do they want to get rid of here? They're getting rid of Hiller? What the hell? Doesn't make any sense. Koivu, Surrey, Winnick. I don't really want any of those players. Um, so bad at trades. Seriously. Okay, what else do we got? We got... Don't we have a two fourth rounds? Yeah. Let's give a Washington's fourth, too. There we go. Alright, that works. I think I gave up a little bit too much, but whatever. It's good enough. Frazier, Hall, and Brennan. Okay. Actually, we give up Frazier, too, I guess. Kyle Palmieri. There we go. Uh, was he on any other lines? I don't... I don't think so, no. Extra attacker, no. No, 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 okay. <coughs> My goodness. Alright, there we go. Uh, okay, so that works for me. There we are. Okay, so we got rid of Clarkson's contract. <laughs> um... Technically, we could get rid of Mark Frazier. He just got traded in real life, actually, so... We could see. I don't think he's worth a whole lot, though. That's a thing. Um, I really don't think he's worth anything. Fraser, yeah, he's not really worth anything at all. Hmm. <laughs> Bozak. See, like, this is the thing. You gotta sweeten it. They don't want to get rid of any players, which sucks. So stupid. God! Hmm. 
Okay, can I get anything out of this trade? There's a three star. Okay, there's two of that. That guy and Weber. They're both 25, though. Uh, Gold. Golobef. I think it's. Yeah, cap space now. Shoot. Okay, we need to get rid of somebody for cap space. God damn. Uh, Mackenzie, Skilly. Oh, Atkinson is just worth too much. That's the thing. Just worth too much. Um. Hmm. Really? That doesn't make the... What? I don't think there's any way I can get freaking Johansson. It sucks. The cap space is just too much. The, th the other thing that I noticed is this doesn't work at all. It doesn't. It makes no sense. Like, look at they got enough cap space now, but it doesn't work. Ah, uh, whatever. I might give up on Johansson. We can work for a trade uh, later. That's fine. I'll keep Bozak for now. That's good. Okay. Uh, continue. I didn't want to make this video too long, but I'm just I'm not very good at trades. So I apologize, but, you know, we got rid of uh, Clarkson, so that's good. I had to give up a little bit much, but whatever. Uh, continue. I don't think we're going to get into tr Nobody wants Bozak. God. All right, there we go. So, um, yeah, let's keep sitting here. All right, so we got rid of Bo or, uh, Clarkson, which is good. Got rid of Clarkson contract. Cause it's horrible. Keep Bozek on the third line there. <coughs> oh man. <laughs> I think for the most part, this first season is just gonna take a little bit more in the simulation area. Um, or sorry, video length, just because of like you know the early moves you need to do for a team. But uh, I think once we once we get past this first year, it should be a lot faster sim wise. <clears throat> All right, Leonard's doing pretty good right now. There we go. All right, keep it going, Leonard. Keep it going. There we go. Forty wins. Leonard's got nineteen. That's good. Kessel's with fifty four points. Yeah. We're almost at, we're at like 68 games right now, so. It's not that great, but you know what, whatever. That's fine. Keep going, Leonard, keep going, bud. Keep going, bud. We're going to lose this game, I think. Oh, we won, wow. Holy crap, Leonard's doing pretty good. Keep going, keep going. Oh my god, we're on a 2, 3, 4, 5... Six, seven, eight, nine. We're on a nine-game win streak right now. Holy crap. All right, keep going. <laughs> We're going to lose to Tampa right now, I bet. Yeah, I <laughs> called it. Totally nailed it. All right. Uh, <clears throat> one sec. We just got to throw in uh, Bernie. How many games does Bernie have? Like I said, we want. I wanted to get him to 35, so he needs three more games. All right, so I'm going to just keep him in for the next three games, regardless of win or loss. Um... And then Leonard's going in for the rest. 35 isn't bad. Actually, I'm going to... I'll reassess. I want to see what uh, Leonard's at for games. Because he's got 21 wins, so he's got to be... He's got to be around 30 games already. Man, come on, Bernier. Seriously. God. You're being a joke out there. Wow. Back-to-back 4-1 losses. Frick, Bernier. Should have kept Reimer. Yeah, douche. <laughs> I don't know. Just out of the stats, it looked like he was a little bit better. Really? Honka's a third-round player? Okay, let's go back here for another month. Jeez, all right. One more game for Bernier, and then he's done for the year. Hopefully. <laughs> he's getting us all our losses right now, so... Unless he wins. I don't know. Oh, he won. Wow, he actually won a game. He actually won a game. My goodness. How many games do they have left? 
Oh, we're getting close. We got three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seven, eight games. Okay, so let's uh, quickly peek here. What do we got for Gorilla? So, Bernie should be at 35 games, I believe. Yep. Okay, what is Leonard at? Mm, Leonard's at 33. And what I said, we have eight games left. So, um, Bernier could stay in for two more, I guess, or one more. That would give seven forty. Yeah, that'd be right. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll leave Bernier in for one more game, and then I'll put Leonard in for the rest. Leonard will stay in for the rest. He's basically our starter, so forty games should be. I think reasonable enough for him. We're probably going to lose here, though. Yep. Man, Bernie, what the hell, dude? You freaking suck. He had a great preseason. That was just blowing nuts. Blowing it. All right, here we go. Let's just do the rest now. I'll try and wrap it up really fast. Uh, Detroit, come on, guys. Bounce back. We're kind of slowing down a bit here. There we go. 44 wins on the year so far. That's pretty good. Doing better than the... I think we're doing better than the real Maple Leafs. I could be mistaken. Well, you can't really compare, I guess, right at this point. But Up to where we stopped was basically where the NHL was. So, <laughs> I think we were doing better. So, that's good. Alright, Boston. Boston, Boston, Boston. Alright, 3 nothing win. There we go. Man, Leonard's a stud. Seriously. He's still only an 82, too, so... All right, Winnipeg. We're at 46 wins, which is good. It's pretty good. If we can get just under 50, that'd be sick. Although, I guess we'll finish around. We could finish with 50. We need, th we need to go three more wins. That's all we have. So, I guess we'll find out right now. Can we finish with 50 wins? Uh, I don't know. There we go. Another win. If we can finish with 50 wins, that's a solid year. We only made a few ch minor changes, which, I mean, Toronto already had a pretty solid... Ah, oh, we lost the... We lost the Panthers! 5-1. Come on. Brutal. All right, Ottawa. Oh, we need to win here. We need to win here. These are crucial points. Uh, come on, guys. Oh, we lost! No! Okay, so 48-30 and 4. I'm assuming we made the playoffs. We finished over 100 points. I don't see why we wouldn't make the playoffs. It'd be very surprising if we didn't. There we go. Okay, so we're taking on Buffalo. <laughs> I told you I was expecting 39 wins, and I got 48. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, so let's look at the stats here, final stats for the season. I'll try and do this as fast as I can. So we finished sixth in the NHL with 100 points even, uh, which is pretty solid. Uh, 2.54 goals for, which is good. 2.5 goals against. So we we did end up more goals for than against, but still, it was very close. Uh, power play, 20.5. Wow. So our power play ended up being disgustingly awesome. Uh, PK-wise, 82.1. Not the best, but, you know, that's fine. I can't believe our power play finished like that. We were, at the start of the year, we were at like 7% or something. And I didn't really change it, so. Other than putting Kessel on the right wing. Switching him in JVR, but who knows? Uh, home 26 14 1, away 22 16 3, last 10 6 4 0. Oh. It's not bad. Oh crap, actually, I wanted to see where we finished in our division. Uh, Atlantic, right there. So we finished second. Yeah, see, that was crucial. If we would have beat Auto, we would have finished first. Blah, 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 blah. Oh well. So we're taking on Buffalo, but we'll do that matchup later. Alright, so player stats. Let's see how everyone finished. I think Kessel finished. Hopefully he finished around 65. That'd be great, but who knows. Oh, nice. 69 points for Kessel. That's pretty good. Uh, Lupo had 56. What did he have last year? 18. He was over a point a game, so... Yeah, that's too bad. Uh, JVR finished with 49. So that's good. He should jump up. Caudry finished with 49, which is better. Although, he was almost a point a game player last year, too. Uh, Kuhlman finished with 49. That's a lot better for him, I think. Uh, Boland with 40 points, which is actually pretty good. Yeah, that's good, too. He should... Well, I don't know if he'll shoot up, but... Uh, Phaneuf had 38. How old is he? He's 29, right? Yeah. 
Um, that'd be great if he could get better, though. Franz in 33 points, and he was on the bottom pairing, although he had power play time. Um, Gardner, did he have power play goals? Three. Gardner had 33 points. Holy crap. Bozak had 29. So, I mean, not the best season for Bozak, but, you know, whatever. Actually, the, well, he did better than last year, but his plus minus is awful. Uh, Morgan Riley had 19 points, which this is his kind of rookie season. So, uh, Gunnarsson, 18. Mason Raymond had 18. White had 16. McClemon had 16. LaRose had 14. McLaren had 5. Palmieri had 4. Plus two, so that's that's good. Clarkson was had a terrible plus minus, I think. Cody CC only played a few games, but you know. Uh, goalie wise, so Leonard ended up with forty one games. Bernier played thirty six, two point two one, two point six three, eighteen fifteen and one, twenty six twelve and one. So he actually had a sick record. That's like a three to one record. Like that's crazy. Uh, goals against, wow! Look at that. Look at that. He played how many more games? He had less goals against. That's crazy. Nine nine one five two nine two eight nine five shutouts for Leonard. Oh, Leonard's an eighty three now too. Holy crap! All right, so Leonard got better. That's good. Uh oh, crap! I was gonna look at the overall. Sorry, sorry guys. I will check that out really fast. I'm I know this is taking too long here, uh, but I promise the videos will start getting shorter. It's just because the all the trades and I suck at trading, so uh, I'll be the first to admit that. <laughs> so eighty two games. Uh, nobody finished a point a game. Wow. Thornton finished with 79. Crosby, Gabrick, Parise, Stamco, Sing. So it was kind of a slow year for everyone. So even Kessel like finished tied for 10th, which isn't bad, honestly. It's not bad at all. Goals, Gabrick had 35. It's not bad, I guess. Assists, I'm assuming Thornton. Yeah, Thornton always finishes up there. Plus minus, Neil plus 32. Power play goals. Eliash. Shorthand goals, mechanic. Okay, that's good. Uh, let's look at defense really fast here. Defense. So defensive points. Shattenkirk finished first. Not bad. Uh, plus minus Shattenkirk. He'll probably win the uh, uh, Norris. Goalie-wise. Wow. There's some good goalies this year. Ay ay ay. All right, so we're done that. Uh, team stats, player stats, no, we're good. All right, so just last thing we're going to look at is progress, and then I'll end, end the video. We'll get into the playoffs next time. All right, so uh, Morgan Riley went from a 74 to a 78 in one season, so that's good. Uh, I'm hoping he gets into the mid-80s by next year, but so far, like, just dirty. Just a dirty year for this kid. Holy crap. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. Uh, Gardner went from an 81 to an 82, and JVR went from a. He didn't actually get that much better. He only got the one thing, but still, that's. Nobody got worse, so that's that's a positive. Uh, AHL Andreas Janssen, apparently, that's how you say it. I thought it was Johnson, but it's not. He went from a 61 to a 70. Wow. Not bad. Uh, Cody CC went from a 74 to a 77. Definitely a good trade. Um, he might actually be NHL ready next year. And if that's the case, then we don't need to re-sign Ian White. That was kind of the, the situation I was in. Uh, Ashton got a little bit plus. Holland got plus. Ross got plus, I believe. Yep. Yeah. Not bad. Okay, let's look at goalies fast. Goalies, Leonard obviously got to an 83, so that's good. Uh, AHL McCollum got from a 65 to a 66. So we had a few players get considerably better. I'm hoping Cody Cece turns into something. But... We got the playoffs, so we're taking on Buffalo in the first round, all right? Thanks for watching, guys.